uh, events. So that is something to watch. The other thing is we talked about that speaking. Trump and his team right now are weighing whether or not he wants to actually give remarks after his trip there, after his court appearance on Tuesday. So right now, this is all in the works. His team is figuring this out. Again, even though they suspected this, they anticipated this, they are just now trying to work out the details as they learn about these charges in real time. Kaylin. All right, Kristen Holmes, thank you. Back with my panel now. Paula, I mean, one of the things that stuck out to me today as we were reporting out what Trump was doing at Bedminster is that one of the aides who is at the center of this, Walt Nalta, was with him yeah. in Bedminster. And of course, what Kristen was talking about there, what Tuesday is going to look like, it also raises the question about what the legal team will look like on Tuesday. Who goes in with him for this appearance? That's a great question because off the top of my head, I believe only one of his attorneys is barred in Florida. Chris Kyes. Exactly. And I think oh, Lindsay Halligan. Halligan. Yeah. yeah. And so depending on how, you know, which form the legal ta team is taking uh, this week, uh, one or two people um, barred in Florida, but they will likely be looking. And, and I know some folks who have, and volunteer to potentially be on the case down there, thinking it would be interesting. One said, hey, it could even be an adventure uh, to join this case. They said, you have no idea. Um, but yeah, they will absolutely likely need to bring in additional counsel in Florida, people with a kind of expertise in this matter who are barred down there, who know the judges. Um, so it'll be interesting to see because as we know, he has had a little bit of difficulty uh, retaining lawyers. There are a lot of law firms who won't take him on. They're worried their bills won't get paid uh, in terms of reputational damage. But there are some really interesting constitutional questions here, but he will absolutely have to recruit likely one or two more lawyers because I don't think he has the right team to bring this to Florida. And not only has he had difficulty, not only has he had difficulty obtaining and retaining lawyers, the lawyers that he has are mostly witnesses against him. Yes. Right? Uh, so they can't, yeah. they can't, you know, there's a lawyer advocacy rule that you cannot be an advocate and a witness in the same trial. So these guys point. are, these guys are conflicted Absolutely. out. Absolutely. Multiple. Hey.